Hello everybody, how are you doing? This is Fadali and in this video we're going to talk about the CD command in the Manjaro Linux and but first of all we have to understand that what is the function of the CD command. The function of the CD command is to navigate through the Linux files and the directories. That's it. So we're going to simply demonstrate it here. So I'm going to open up the terminal. Okay, so first of all, let me just write the ls uh, to see the directories. Okay, so we have these folders here in the home folder. So I just want to go to the R1. So for that, I will simply write the CD and I'm going to write the name of the R1. Okay, so there are the two things that uh, so you can navigate through the Linux directories by two different kind of paths. One is the relative one and the second one is the absolute or the full path. Right now, I'm using the relative one. You can use the relative path when you are trying to navigate into the subdirectory of the directory of the folder you are currently working so for example right now i'm in the home folder and i want to go to the r1 which is the subdirectory of the home folder so i'm going to simply write the cd and r1 now i'm going to simply write the pvd just to uh, see the path okay so we are currently into the r1 and in the r1 i just want to see what is uh, in the r1 so we have the r2 folder i also want to go to the r2 folder okay so for that i'm going to simply uh, write the cd and r2 and we are into the r2 folder so from now if you want to change the directory to another folder which is completely not related to your current directory or the directory which are currently in so for example i just simply want to go to the downloads folder here for that i have to use the complete path or the absolute path which is home this is the home this is the complete path for the uh, download directory so i'm gonna simply write the enter and now we are into the download folder this is how you can use the relative and the absolute path uh, while using the cd command okay so there are the other couple of things that are really important in the cd command so for example i just want to go back to my previous directory which was the r2 so what i will need to do here i'm gonna simply write the cd and i'm gonna use the hyphen and it will take me back to the directory i was previously in so as you can see here now i am into the r2 folder which was my previous directory if you just want to move the one directory up so for example if i just want to go from r2 to the r1 so i'm gonna simply write the cd and then i'm gonna write the two dots so this is how you can move the one directory up so now i just want to see the path pvd so if you just directly want to go to your home folder for that you're gonna simply write the cd and it will directly jump to your home folder so you can see that now we are simply into our home folder so this is how it works this is how the cd command work and this is all for this video if you really find this useful hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and bye bye